Spend a couple moments now with Dino Gini, head coach here at Immaculata High School, head coach of both the boys and the girls, senior girls uh, basketball teams, which is pretty amazing, double gold as well. Just take me through this year because it was such a special year and such a great story. Yeah, it's well, it's the, first of all, I got the okay from the boss to do the girls team. Uh, girls are a great team, uh, very athletic. Um, so I was looking forward to it and I took the challenge of doing two teams and it's, it's definitely a challenge, made me a better coach. Preparation mm -hmm. for two teams versus one team, uh, practice time, game schedules, game preparation. So uh, uh, you know it was hard, but it, it was it was well we were successful. Yeah. So it was uh, it, it was a great experience for two really good teams, like two great kids uh, uh, as far as the kids and the parents. So it was mm -hmm. it was good. Any was, any no. time a, a team maybe feel a little neglected that their head coach is paying too much attention to the boys or the girls team? No, it was good. It was yeah. good. I got two great um, Doug Sperling, my assistant coach. Uh, for our a guys program, plus my son Dario stepped in after UBCO, mm -hmm. so we had nice. And then I had good assistant coaches with uh, the girls program, so it, it, that didn't happen. Um, so yeah, it was pretty good. Actually, you know what? As far as painting a picture to do two teams, uh, it worked out great. There was none of that, which I thought maybe there might be, uh, but I don't think I favored the team, even though my son was on one team. Yeah. Uh, so it, it turned out good. Uh, it, it, it was a lot of work, but it was so gratifying because of the kids and their success and they're just good kids that have got good success mm -hmm. so you keep tally of the hours the hours that you've logged not only in the gym but yeah. thinking about lineups and schemes well i, I was telling the uh, preparation be behind the scenes as far as tournaments and scheduling and games and and getting competition to make our teams get to that level and yeah. then uh yeah practice schedules so it, I, I never kept track the hours it, <laughs> it doesn't work if i actually keep track if yeah. i write it down it doesn't work so what'd you learn from each team uh, Make you a better coach. Yeah, I, I think I, uh, preparation was huge. Yeah, um, and I learned to delegate, which I'm not good at. I, I learned to give responsibility to my assistant coaches, which I, I, I never was good at because I'm always the head coach. So, and in high school, you don't get the always get the great coaches, but I do have mm -hmm. great coaches. So uh, I think I was teaching them to teach my kid, to teach our kids, and to show what is good and what is not, and what a practice needs to be at, and what pace it has to be at. So. I think they learned a lot, and uh, I learned more even teaching them. So, mm -hmm. Double gold. Boys win gold provincials. Girls win gold provincials. What do you do for an encore? Are you back, first of all? Yeah, I'm, I'm back. Yeah. 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 So I'll, I'll do the girls and the guys. Um, next year, we lose the big guy, obviously. Yeah. Um, but you know what? We'll be compa we'll, the guys will be competitive, very competitive. Um, and the girls will they'll be the team to beat mm. in uh, the, provincial, uh, the, the senior circuit, so mm -hmm. for girls. I know you have volleyball teams or soccer teams come. Hey. Come coach our team now? I know. <laughs> no, I mean, uh, like I said, we, you and I were talking before we got in there as far as uh, I think we used five provincial titles. Uh, yeah. The soccer girls just won gold mm -hmm. at golf. So a, bi a big year uh, yeah. for a small school. So. Well, one of the reasons why we're here is we, through the website, randwaters.ca, we were taking nominations for High School Coach of the Year. Your name popped up, I think, obviously. Um, and through the voting process, you have been selected the winner oh. of the second annual High School Coach of the Year. What does that awesome. mean? Awesome. That's awesome. I, you know what? That, uh, um, getting that sort of like a high five and get recognition is, is great. I, I do it for the kids, but uh, always getting a little pat on the back helps. So well, more I, I really appreciate what you do. I have more than a high five and more than a pat on the back. You have won the ultimate sports ticket package. So I have tickets for the Kelowna Falcons, the Kelowna Rockets, the West Kelowna Warriors, the Kelowna Chiefs. I'd give you tickets to the UBC Okanagan Heat, but I think you have a lifetime pass. Yeah, I've got pass there. <laughs> so by the, I, th I really appreciate it. I, well, it means a lot. And maybe the piece de resistance. And let me get it for just a second. Courtesy of Shutout Sports Collectibles, Alex Draper and his company there, we have got this wonderful 11 by 14 autographed frame photo of Shea Weber oh, in his awesome. Team Canada that's awesome. gear. So then that's, that's again, awesome. shout out sports uh, awesome. and collectibles. Much appreciated, much appreciated. Dino Gini, the second ever RyanWaters.ca High School Coach of the Year, double gold medal, and now the owner of a Shea Weber autograph photo. Congratulations. Thanks very much. Thank you. Thanks for watching.